You wanna be in your first more with Moro's video? Yeah, bam. Do you wanna be in your first more? Say yes, yes, yes I do. Oh my gosh. Yes I do. Oh, I Puppies do. have like energy like no other. They're like little toddlers almost. Heck, they Especially are little toddlers. Like little dogs, they have too much energy. They do have a lot of, well, I don't know. Luna has a lot of energy too. <laughs> She's got a lot of like energy that she lets out sporadically. Yes, but we just wanna say that it's gonna be a kind of, I always hate saying- It's a say, different video. Di yeah, I would say but it's a different- a little bit is. But I mean, it's fine because it pertains to me and Frank, or Frank and I, sorry, improper grammar, but it pertains to just Frank and I and kind of like our wellness routine. We yeah, wanted to like share what that we, with you guys. It's kind of like what we do like throughout the day it's of the how life. we like keep ourselves in check yep. with what we eat, how we work out, like we take our vitamins. It's routine, It's everything. our routine. It's what we want to do every day. It's what we strive to do every <laughs> single day. So kind of like a day in the life. It's like our wellness day in the life. Yes, but day like our life, wellness, wellness health, everything kind of video. So we hope that you guys enjoy it and it kind of gives you a little bit more of an insight because I think this year and definitely in the past five months, we have started to take our health more seriously yes. and taking care of ourselves in different ways, like with working out, running, what we're eating, uh, like Frank said, Stop vitamins. Eating so, like eating yeah. out so much. And taking care of Frank's hair <laughs> and trying try to, keep, to. Yeah. so like I know you guys are probably gonna be like well he, you keep it short anyways yes. or yes but it's also because I like having hair I like feel well oh, you can't oh. really grow it out because I it can, is very thin, is thin but he is taking care of his existing hair we don't what I want to keep yeah I don't want it to get to. worse <laughs> At least not right now. So we talked a little bit about, actually in the next clip, we'll talk more about what Frank has been doing with that. We're gonna cut this intro really short. Actually, we're filming this right before our we run. run. <laughs> so we're, I was like, wait, should we wait until after? I'm like, no, we're yeah. gonna be like a hot sweaty mess. So we wanna go ahead and just film this intro really quick just to let you guys know what it's gonna be about, what to expect, and we hope that you guys enjoy it. See what Frank's up to. How's he doing? <laughs> what you up to? You know, just try not to be bald anymore. <laughs> Hopefully, I want to grow some hair. So, I don't know if the peeps on more with Moros might know, but maybe give like a quick rundown of what you got. Was it a couple of years ago? So, two years ago, yeah, we went ago. to Atlanta to get what's called a microdermal pigmentation, which <laughs> gave me like the look of having natural hair, mm -hmm. but it really didn't help grow hair, if that makes sense. Um, so, what our store has graciously stepped in and done is help me restore my hair mm -hmm. and get it to start growing again. So using the low level light, it's got like 280 uh, two LEDs and lasers in here. They're like they're the correct like levels and everything. So it actually oh, so really helps. Better than the one that you had before then. So, yeah. I see Frank putting it on when he's doing the cups to kind of yes. like knock it out first thing in the morning when we're working. That way he can get two things done at once and because we're busy and we're always on the always. go. So, yeah. And what's really nifty with this too is my battery is actually dead so it should be charging but you can unplug it and it's portable so you don't have yep. to be plugged into a wall you can mm -hmm. just use your little portable charger clip it on your side and go about your day. So, and it's also only 25 minutes and it's every other day is what you need to do to get your hair to start looking luscious again. So it's crazy because like I just cut my hair but when I noticed when I yeah. cut everything I had a lot more hair come oh, off than normal. Oh it was thicker. So it was a little bit thicker and I noticed that like there was a little bit more and it wasn't like peach fuzz cat were like baby mm. hair it was actual hairs so wait how long have you been wearing this so right now i'm looking at about three months which is usually when you start to see results which was between like the three month and the six month range yeah, so i'm like really excited back. that this is actually doing its job and working really well so hopefully we can go from like this okay. go grab the leg <laughs> where's that i don't have a leg wait, wait, so so we can go from that to <laughs> To this. <laughs> so it's just like watering your plants. When you water your plants, it's either in a growing, resting, or just kind of dormant phase, I would believe. Mm -hmm. And when you do the low level therapy and you do your vitamins and your shampoos, it pretty much restarts that process. So you're growing, you're replenishing, and you're hydrating your hair all at the same time. I feel like you also love it because it's gonna like help me boost my confidence more because I have struggled with hair loss for years. Since high school. Since high school. So like, I started thinning in high school in like the back and then once, I don't know, once we had kids and once we had more friends, <laughs> it started going away right here. Which is why he did the, Which is why pigmentation, did the pigmentation to make his hair look fuller and it's supposed to mimic the look of follicles. So it's great 
but at the same time I was like Frank you need to also have something to like protect the hair that you still have now and be able to at least do something with the hair that you still have now if that makes sense yes and also they were gracious enough to send me some like Flintstone gummies but for, <laughs> but for so, adults like, these things, yeah, so these things they take care of all of your hair vitamins and pretty much it all in one little vitamin you take your hair you do the low level therapy. So I'm assuming it probably has biotin in it. Antioxidants, and... vitamin C and E and coconut oh. oil. It says it's for thinning hair. So, and they also send shampoo and conditioner as well. I'm involved too because I have to remind Frank to take care of himself and to take care of his hair. But we want to say thank you to Iowa Store for reaching out and, and sending us all of let Frank stuff. try that because I was actually looking at something like that because their Amazon reviews were amazing. amazing. They had really, really good Amazon reviews. So I was like, okay, well, you know, we were looking at it a while back when we were going through that whole process yes, because they were pretty much open to like whatever I could use like mm -hmm. back then they were mm -hmm. like yeah, you could try this or try that mm -hmm. and then um, once this opportunity come up I was like yes we've got to right. do it right and also I found out that some of the uh, ingredients that were in the products that he was using before was oh, ah, they actually had really <laughs> negative side effects so with these products you don't have to worry about that at all so I want to make sure because right I'm always the one like when I'm buying products and looking at products I'm always like okay what's in it gotta make sure yes. I feel gotta like make sure it's natural for your hair or healthy for your right. hair and I don't know if it's like a generalization but sometimes men they don't look into that kind of and stuff I really, and it's one of those <laughs> things where you're just like oh it's just hair but yeah. then like at the no, end of the day you're like you gotta make sure you better take care of yeah. it because it's Oh, you got. Yeah, and you want to make sure you're using the right ingredients too. So I restore their ingredients good, really good. So if you have a hubby or a boyfriend or a dad or just somebody you know in your life that is also going through this, dealing with their self-esteem or confidence, maybe check out iRestore because they also gave us a coupon to give you guys. And apparently you can save hundreds. Oh. So by using the code MOROS, you can save go. hundreds of dollars off of your mm -hmm. order from Iris Store. Yeah. And also want to mention really quickly that they have a 12 month money back guarantee. Oh, okay. on all of I didn't know products. that. It's been working for Frank. We haven't had any, he hasn't had any. I don't uh, have any issues. I was gonna say, we don't have any issues, but he doesn't have any issues. But I mean, it's good to know that there is that money back guarantee just in case it doesn't work out for you. But we also just want to say thank you so much for Iris Store for sponsoring today's video yes, and so for much. spending spending and for sending us all or well, sending me all of these amazing products and reminding frank to take do it care of your stuff every day like i said it helps that he puts it on while he's doing the cups that way he can at least multitask yeah. while doing it as well but and it's um, just been like one of those things tonight where i was just like oh, i didn't get time to today like it was dead we're about so to put it on and we're, about to we're gonna to finish <laughs> we're gonna finish the 13 minutes here and we're gonna be off for our day all right, guys, so now to get into the food portion of this video, I feel like, I, well, I'm only speaking for myself. I'm not speaking for Frank, but I'm speaking for myself. And, the, and when I say that, I am such a creature of habit with what I eat. Like, I could eat the same, like, two or three things, like, two to three different breakfasts and then two to three different lunches and dinners all the time because I just like what I like and I'm not even a picky eater so anyways the reason why I'm saying this is because this is usually what I have every single morning for breakfast sometimes it will change sometimes I'll have eggs or toast or cereal but for the most part Frank and I will have our yogurt in the morning with some frozen fruit we love to use frozen fruit but of course you can use fresh some granola and agave and every single morning i make my greens it's my red and greens drink and then i'll add collagen to it as well just to kind of get me going and energized for the day and it has so many amazing stuff in it i definitely recommend incorporating greens into your diet for me personally it has helped with so much of my bloating that i had before i had a lot of digestive issues and ha since i've been taking the reds and the greens Every single day, it has helped so so much with Did that. You purposely tried to dress like me today. I think so. Well, you wanted I, saw to your, match? I saw your outfit and I was like, hmm, I got a shirt that looks like that, and I know I've got black shorts, so I figured, hey, why not? It's a new yogurt, and it's not as sweet as the one we were getting before. It's Which healthier you, for you. What There's what just not enough. Before? Oh crap! What was that brand? It was a Greek yogurt brand, but there was a lot of sugar in it. Well, I shouldn't say a lot of sugar. It was a, a lot, but you could probably taste the difference. This doesn't have as I much can. sugar. And usually Frank doesn't do the agave, but this morning, since we tr were trying a new one, he's like, I need that little bit of sweetness. Yeah, that's much better. But yeah, this is my outfit. Amazon 
a dupe for the Lululemon Align Tank kick-ass leggings. I haven't got my tennis shoes on yet today, so I just have my slides. Frank has his slides. Shirt is Nike. From the outlet. From the, oh yeah, that's right. And your pants are the Amazon ones, right? Amazon, yes. If y'all know me, all I'll wear is gym shorts. No, that's all I want to wear is just workout clothes. Workout clothes Unless we're going somewhere. Shorts. Unless we're like tonight, we're going out to dinner tonight. Mm -hmm. Other than that, it's workout mm. clothes and gym shorts. Which I'll have to show like what I get when we go out to eat. Oh yes. Well, I'm, I'm probably not gonna show what I'm gonna eat. It's okay, it's okay, but I'll show what I usually eat to stay healthier, but still be able to enjoy a meal. I like to call yeah, them treat so, meals, not cheat meals, but treat. You're treating yourself, you're rewarding yourself for all your hard well, work. Well, it's to today, so. Yeah. Oh, that's true. Well, maybe maybe they'll go out the window for dinner. <laughs> <laughs> so, a lot of times for lunch, we love to get the grilled nuggets from Chick-fil-A. So, if you still want to be able to enjoy fast food every now and then, or if you're having a really busy day, like we are a lot of the times, we just like to get these grilled nuggets from Chick-fil-A and you can either have it with buffalo sauce or barbecue sauce. I love the Polynesian sauce. I'll get a side kale salad and Frank's not a huge greens person or salad person so usually he'll get fruit of some kind. And then this is one of our go-to snacks if we are hungry in between meals. Just a simple rice cake with some peanut butter. You can put any kind of fruit, blueberries, strawberries. I personally love to do bananas on it. Plus it's really good for like a before workout snack. And sometimes I'll even have like a protein shake as well. And I actually did not get to film our dinner like I wanted to. We were just enjoying my late birthday dinner that I didn't have because we were not feeling so great and things just kind of got pushed back. So I didn't get to show you guys that, but I can tell you we had some calamari as as an appetizer, I had a Caesar salad before my meal. Frank got a, I think it was a New York strip steak with rice pilaf, and then I got stuffed shrimp. I think it was like a lobster or crab. I can't even remember now, but stuffed. And for my side, I got asparagus. So just like eating healthy, drinking water, working out, vitamins are just as important. I cannot stress taking vitamins enough just because there's so many different benefits for so many different things. So I wanna to talk to you guys about the vitamins that I take and then just a little bit of the ones that Frank takes. He's not a huge vitamin person like I am, so his is kinda of small. So it has really helped with staying on track and taking vitamins every single day, because trust me, I know it can be a struggle or forgetting, is I just put everything and these little pill organizers, so we have Frank's right here, mine is right here. You can see a huge difference between how much I take and how many Frank takes. So some of the bottles I just actually ran out this week, so it looks like a lot of vitamins in here and not enough bottles, but I just ran out of vitamin D, so I have vitamin D in here. I do take biotin for my hair, skin, and nails, and then I have my Equilibria CBD gummies, and then also their daily soft gels are in here as well. And then I do take a blocker, a hair blocker. This just helps support stronger, thicker, and fuller hair, so I'm taking that, as well as a bioactive woman's one daily multivitamin and I also just ran out of my balance. mood balance. I swear by You can tell a difference in my I can tell a difference. Like if you have that, you're like a little bit pretty, more calmer. Well you're mellow about like a lot of things, but if you don't have it, you're like my stress is oh, out of God, control. Get this done. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I don't know what it is about the mood balance in this V Thrive. I don't even think it's a placebo. I'm telling you guys I can definitely tell a difference when I don't have it, so I need to order some more. We were getting ready for bed last night, and I was like, something's been off. Like, what? You've it's also been, been like the first week bit, of school. The first week of school, yeah. Oh, Our man. stress has been up a little bit more like, than so usual. Like, there was normal stress, and then there's first week of school stress. Yes. And then I was like, are you okay? Is like everything okay? And you were like, well, I ran out of my mood balance pill, and I was like, oh. That explains that, it. That would, I need that to order two it. bottles. That way. Brittany swears <laughs> that I could take it. You can, yeah, so, anybody can take it, men just as well. So it's not like just for women or men, so I'm gonna order some more of that. And then, uh, let's see what else. I have my uh, daily omega-3s, so this is also great for, well, just omega-3s in general are really good, but also good for a healthy heart. But I also have some bromelain in here, which I just ran out. I've been taking that 
since my surgery and it's helped with recovery and I just went ahead and took the rest of the vitamins and I think that's it for me usually I have cranberry ones in here to help with urinary tract infections um, I used to get them when I was pregnant with Fletcher or easily get them with Fletcher so I've always been paranoid of getting them again even though I don't have like a huge track record of getting them i just like to take them just in case because they also have a lot of other vitamins like vitamin c in them so i need to order some more of those and then for frank he also takes vitamin d um, yeah, but I also the vitamin d the men's multivitamin and then i also take my i restore gummies. gummies yes every single day and this is filled so like if y'all can kind of see this but it's filled with biotin and antioxidants vitamin c and e and coconut oil yeah, so we... it's pretty much all of this stuff mm -hmm. but in a gummy form yes and we talked about that earlier about his treatment and doing all that yes. so we won't go into that but we just wanted to show you guys everything that we're taking because this is just important as well and this is just for us too i don't even want to get you guys started on the kids and what we give them i mean i guess i can go ahead and yeah. show you guys even though the this is shop. yeah even though this is mainly pertaining to us and what we do as a couple to stay fit healthy and just our overall wellness but you guys we take this stuff so seriously that we have a whole cabinet dedicated, dedicated just for medicine vitamins supplements anything and everything that we need and anything and everything that the kids need and Fletcher needs. We have baby stuff up there as well. Everything, everything is in here for any kind of sickness, any kind of wellness. It's just, it's there, it's there because that is how important it is to us. All right guys, so we are getting towards the end of this video. The last thing that we are gonna do to show you guys our daily, or should I say semi-daily, because it's not every single day and honestly every day does differ. But for the most part, this is what our daily routine is as a couple. As far as like what we eat, as far as like the vitamins that we do, the iris store that Frank does. What keeps us in shape. What keeps us in shape and healthy. I mean, we're not an expert by any means. I just want to say that. We do like to incorporate some kind of a workout or run. Before, we were working out almost daily. I don't remember talking about it on this channel. We talked about it somewhere that we Frank- talked about it a lot on Instagram. Yeah, Frank hurt his hand, so it's been harder for him to lift weights like, and then- Well, we're like six months, or no, like we're like four months removed from me breaking my hand. It's been four months now. And I still can't use it. That's crazy. So it's, it's, it's one of those things where like I go out into the garage and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm excited to lift weights because I guess for that day my hand hasn't been hurting. And then I'll go out there and pick something up and it's like, mm, Yeah, you know, and the doctor do said that's normal. It's gonna be weak for a few months. Um, you have to regain yeah. that strength back in your hand. So he definitely said it would be sore for at least four to six months afterwards. But I, I don't want to panic too soon. I wanted to see, I wanted to get better. I think better. you need to go back and see. So if we it debated got on this again today too. We were like, do we go back? Do we spend more money to get another like second opinion on it, or just kind of? Because it's still bothering. Because it still hurts me every day. So Frank's had to stop uh, lifting weights and picking up heavier things because of that, and just to see when or if it would fully heal first within the time, of course. But like I said, we might need to go back for a second opinion. And then I was having a lot of, I've talked about this on my Instagram, a lot of pelvic tilted pelvis. I talked about this um, and going to the chiropractor and doing stretches. So I had to put a hold on working out too. So instead, also, also behind closed doors and like not filming and not filming our workouts, mm -hmm. like on Instagram, your posture has gotten so much better. Yeah, you I do. will say that. Maybe I'll go more in depth and talk about this a little bit more in another video and, you know, show you guys the stretches that I was doing because it's really helped and my posture has gotten better. So I probably am, I'm probably able to start working out again. Yeah, maybe. For sure. I can but, still do lower body yeah, stuff. You can it's do just like my upper legs. body or stuff that requires me to lift a whole just bunch of weight with my hand. Do I just can't. Heavy stuff. Yeah. So instead, we've kind of found like a happy medium and we go running instead. So we'll just run around our neighborhood for a little bit at night, about between anywhere between like a mile to two miles, depending on like how, how far we, we can go and how we feel and if we've been like doing a lot that day. Like today, we've been doing a lot. So maybe we'll just go one mile one tonight. Mile. So let's show Frank's before run. Yeah, before. I'm all Footage. happy. <laughs> Not 
like red as a tomato. Oh, that's me. I get so red when I'm running. And then this is my before. It's so humid out too. It is humid tonight. All right, we gotta stop complaining. We gotta go do this. Just, just go get, get your music in. So we actually were only able to do a mile tonight. It was like extra hot and humid tonight and we just, we couldn't do it. We couldn't push through the run. So we only did a mile, but still doing at least something, even if it's just a walk or some jump rope, just doing a little something here and there, not even every single day, but maybe a handful of times a week. I'm telling you, we can definitely tell the difference. I know if I even go a few days without doing something, I can definitely tell a difference. But at the same time, I try not to put too much of a pressure on us because I know sometimes it's not ideal to work out every single day, especially with our busy schedule. But for the most part, that is what our wellness routine and day in life is like. We hope that you guys enjoy this video. Don't forget to check out iRestore. Everything will be down below. And again, thank you guys so much for watching. We will see you in our next one. Bye guys.